Hello everyone and welcome to get back to John's food review. Today we're going to be trying useless shit. Limited time flavor Lay's Cheetos cheese. Why? Why make a potato chip flavor of something we already have that comes in a bag like this or those little convenient ones, you know, you know, big game. You know, hey guys, I brought the little chips variety packs. Who wants them? Me, I want Cheetos. Where's the Cheetos? Um, I said the same thing with the Funyuns. Funyuns are already small, com you know, compact and bite-sized. You know, they're, they're small snacks. Why do you need a Lay's chip flavor? And this was the least of the evil ones. I, the, the other one was Cool Ranch Dorito. So you're making a potato chip taste like another potato chip. Why? So, since Cheetos aren't technically chips, but this, the idea is still fucking stupid. I mean, really, let this sink in. Lay's making a chip that tastes like a Cheeto, which is already... You know, bite, you know, they come in different sizes because they're all, like, crunchy little. But, why? So. What happens when the cheesiness of Cheetos snacks meets the delicious crispiness of... But they're already, cr well, not crispy, they're crunchy, so... Open the bag and find out. Down there. Yeah, down there. Oh, Frito? Again, why would you make a potato chip taste like another potato chip? Yeah, we had the Fritos ones. Or not the Fritos, the, um, uh, Funyun. Oh, that's, uh, the, um, Fritos chili, uh, chili cheese ones. I mean, those are great. But, wow. You know... When you make something taste like something else, it's like the Oreos, okay? You know, when you have, like, birthday cake. Cookies and cake are two different things. You know, you're taking that huge, bold flavor of that, that cake and compressing it into a little, small, bite-sized cookie. You know, some people like that taste of birthday cake and want to have it all year, and then and they can't keep affording to uh, spend it on big birthday cakes. So they have a nice little bite-sized cookie you can just pick up um, and you get all that birthday cake flavor in a small cookie but they're just taking chips that come in bags like this and they're just making them taste like other chips that come in bags like this why and of course it's like, it smells kind of like Cheetos. <clears throat> but then Lay's has a very distinct, like, potato-y smell to it. So you open the bag and you don't get Cheetos. You get Lay's. Here's a nice big one. I mean, it's orangey-ish. I taste no Cheetos. And that's the problem with Lay's. Like I said, very distinct flavor with the chips. I'm not I'm not tasting any Cheetos. Let me find one with. I mean, let's just. I'll rest it on my tongue and see if the some of the, you know. Okay, these suck. Those are bad.
It's like, I can't even say they taste bad because they don't taste like anything. They just taste like Lay's chips. I mean, everyone knows Lay's chips have a very distinct flavor to them. Uh, and that's all I taste. I don't taste any of the cheese from the Cheetos. So I guess I really can say, where's the Cheetos? Because I, I don't taste any of it. Kind of... And that one had a lot of powder on it. <laughs> yeah, a lot of powder. I'm just tasting fried potato. Don't get these. They're supposed to taste, at least taste like what they were saying they're supposed to taste like, but they don't even taste like Cheetos. They just taste like regular Lay's chips. I don't know, like I said, I don't know why you'd want a potato chip that tastes like a Cheeto when Cheetos already come in bags like this. Like with the, the Cool Ranch Doritos. Why would I want a Cool Ranch Dorito Lay's when I could just buy Cool Ranch Doritos? It makes no fucking sense. It's so fucking stupid. You know, it's... it's you know, it's like with uh, ice cream flavors. You know, when you get like a, a brownie ice cream, uh, ice cream flavor, you know, you're taking something that's, you know, kind of chewy, uh, kind of crunchy. You know, you, some of them, some people like those end pieces, you know, the nice little burnt. And you get that flavor in an ice cream, which is soft, decadent, uh, smooth. So taking a flavor with a certain textural profile and putting it into another one with a profile that's completely different makes sense. Like I said, with the cookie, you're taking a big old fucking cake and you're taking that flavor and you're condensing it into a little cookie about that size. So you get that big flavor from the cake in a small cookie. But here they're like, oh, let's just take Cool Ranch Doritos chips, which are already potato chips, and make Lay's Cool Ranch Dorito chips. It makes no fucking sense. Makes no fucking sense. Who thought this was going to be a good idea? I'm... All right, so we've tried the fun, you know, we've tried the, the cool range. There's just. I would say let me get the others, but there's there's no point because they're already potato chips. I don't want to have a potato chip that just tastes like another potato chip, you know. And unfortunately, with these, there's there's no taste of Cheetos. It's unfortunately late now. If it was like Pringles, well, then again, Pringles sometimes Pringles is a fucking mixed bag with those. I mean, sometimes you'll get a a, a canister. And, like, the whole thing will just be completely just uh, coated with the flavor. And then sometimes you'll open up and there'll be nothing at all. So, like, the pizza ones. I love the pizza ones. Sometimes you get them and they're just completely, like, red. Both sides completely red because of the color, uh, the, the flavoring. And then sometimes you'll open them up. I open them up and there's nothing. They don't taste like anything except for a, a chip. Like a regular flavor so if it was like that where you know you open it up and they were just coated that would be different but lays has this problem where they're very very stingy with the coating you know the the flavoring that they put on their chips um the the bold the the, the flavor of the cheeto works well with what it's on it's a small little crunchy bit and the, the flavor works well but here like i said the, the ship already has a distinct flavor and unfortunately it seems like it's overpowering the flavor of the cheeto a cheesy flavor um 
that's why Cheetos work well with what they are. You know, potato chips like Lay's tend to hardcore taste like potato. And it, it's kind of hard to overpower that. Uh, so. Now, there are certain flavors like the, um, the chicken and waffle ones. Those are really good. Um, because chicken and waffle, I mean, it's not really, you're not really tasting a waffle. You're tasting more like maple syrup, which it's a sweet, old flavor. The chicken, very distinct flavor. Like, first you get the chicken taste, and then you get, like, the sweet aftertaste of syrup. And it's really, really fucking good. But that's a good thing, because it, 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 it kind of overpowers that potato flavor. I mean, first, when you first bite into it, naturally the potato flavor. But then you get that chicken flavor. And then you get that sweet syrup at the end. It's just, it works. But this, because the, the, they're not putting a good amount of dusting on it, of, of, of the Cheeto flavor, just doesn't work. I wish they would stop fucking doing this shit. Stop making potato chips taste like other potato chips. If I want Cheetos, I'll buy Cheetos. If I want Cool Ranch Doritos, I'll just buy Cool Ranch Doritos. I don't need to buy Lay's, which is... So, it's like, buy Lay's and have it taste like a Cheeto or a Cool Ranch and have it be inferior and not taste like it at all. Or just buy the real thing. Lay's. Stop. Just stop. But who knows? Maybe I'm just, maybe I just have a bad batch as usual. <laughs> but um, if you guys have let me, uh, if you guys have had these, let me know. But for me, this, I tried, you saw, I tried several and they all taste exactly the same. There's no flavor at all. I saw these at a food line and I'm like, okay. They were sitting right next to the, uh, the cool ranch ones. And I'm like, <laughs> no. So I picked the uh, lesser of two evils here. Boy, I was disappointed. That's the first time I think I've ever had a potato chip and that's just been like, wow. Normally Lay's can do some pretty cool things with the chips, you know, depending on the flavor, but this one, the, the, the flavor is just, it doesn't work with the chip. It works with what Cheetos are. You know, they... If you want it to taste like Cheetos, you have to overcompensate and realize that your chip has a distinct flavor already. You can't just do a little light dusting and then, oh, check it out flavor. No, it has to be like caked on there, you know, in order to taste anything. And that's one thing with the Cheeto. If you notice, a lot of the places are like caked on with flavor. So, same thing with Doritos. If you look at Doritos, a lot of the chips are like caked with uh, the the flavor and that's what gives them such a bold taste but here they're like okay we're good now uh but yeah let me know if you had them and if you want to try them you better hurry limited time back by unpopular demand requested by no one a chip that tastes like another chip. Well, Cheetos really don't count as chips, but you know what I'm saying. Now, Cool Ranch Doritos are chips. If I want a Cool Ranch Dorito flavored chip, I would just get Cool Ranch Doritos. There's no reason for Lay's to do it when it's much, it, it's way more inferior. You know, so the, the Cool Ranch Dorito, like the Dorito chip itself, it, it's designed for these certain flavors and it does it perfectly. Lay's just would not be able to do it. If I feel like I got those ones instead, I'd be saying the same thing right now. But yeah, let me know. Anyways, you guys know the drill. I'll see you guys later. Bye guys.